Welcome to Strategic Trade Act 2010 Educational Videos. In this episode, we'll guide you through the STA 2010 licensing process. An STA permit is required for activities related to strategic items and technology. There are four types of permits issued under the STA 2010 Single, Multiple, Bulk and Special Permit with different validity dates. All permits shall be issued by respective permit issuance agencies, depending on the category code. The owner of the strategic items shall be responsible for applying for an STA permit, which includes any person within the supply chain and a conveyance and agent acting on behalf of the owner. It is the responsibility of each party to the supply chain to do proper due diligence when it comes to strategic items as provided under STA 2010. For the purpose of application, the exporter is advised to conduct due diligence and to ensure the business transaction is legitimate. It is important for business owners to run checks on business transactions related to strategic items against the sanctioned list issued by the UNSCR particularly on restricted end-user lists and the prohibited list of individuals and entities. Please be aware of the proliferation risk and attempt to circumvent the shipment. STA permit can be applied through Daganya e-permit STA and will be considered within a stipulated time frame. The system interfaces with the customs information system and the exporter shall indicate the issuance of the STA permit in the customs declaration form. It is important to complete Form 6, Delivery Verification Statement, within two months from the date of export. In the final episode, we'll explore penalties, compound and compliance. Stay tuned. <laughs>